Hello everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Stellaris Grand Admiral 25 Times Crisis Syncretic Evolution. I'm your host, Cos Fade. Very excited to be here. It's episode 6. It's year 2280. This is what the Empire looks like, the Darzakia. And we're trying to get out from underneath the need to buy consumer goods. That's the big thing right now. We're buying 60, and that's way too many. I want to get out from underneath those, and then I can colonize these last remaining planets. And in fact, over here, this, um, I believe we're already colonizing this Gaia world, but there's a bunch of stuff to do there. So I'm waiting for two more people to show up on this planet, Pythem, and then we can set to work. I also need to start getting some crystals down. We're researching that technology right here. Synthetic crystal plants, 13 months away. So that'll help. And we got a little Empire Sprawl going on. We only have two Sprawl planets right now. Hanham Ta 3, which has uh, some people in it. So, they're there doing nothing, and we could. See, I could take these people at Pythem and move them to Hanham. Oh, it's an Alpine world. That wouldn't work. Nope. These guys are on their own. These are uh, current population. They're growing a lot of these, the Penthulans. So. We got a little bit going on with these different biomes, so we can't just willy-nilly shuffle people around, even though we might like to. And I'm starting to really get over my sprawl again, and now we're at technology cost 10.92, which is why I don't want to be, so I really, really want to get some, uh, I really want to, want to get that taken care of. This place is going to grow, is going to do civilian industries, so... I think do I want to wait for that city district to get me or do I just want to pop this up probably this and in the city so we got some work to do yep and this just got made so that takes that helps mean we can buy less which is great so let's get suspected and here we got this traditions so this picks up the last one fleet command limit plus 20 and admiral cap increased by two gets us another one of these and Xeno compatibility, which I don't care about. So we have to wait now, because the big thing I want is our college and media anti-gravity engineering project. So, so we're just gonna be waiting on that, which is fine. And food is gonna take a little hit. Selling, which is fine. I'll just do this. So it's that balancing act. And we actually have a... Oh, and what's this science ship doing? That one's over there, and why aren't you digging? Oh, because we lost a person there. Okay, do we have anybody who's doing that? Nope, we don't have anybody with the architectural... Oh, we don't have anybody with that. So we'll just grab the youngest person. And tell you, go dig that site, excavate that. And then him... Oh yeah, build these. Build mining right now. We're trying to get him to fill in the gaps. We finally have some influence because we went through all of our research packs and turned them off because um, everybody's benefiting from us being uh, huge on research, but we don't need everybody riding our coattails. So. Defensive pack with the Chinner Combine. Ooh, that's sad. So the Chinner Combine now has a defensive pack with somebody, which is not good. They're probably, they're our biggest threat right now. Which also reminds me, I need to start getting this built up a little bit more. Migration treaty. I should probably, hmm. So one of the things we have is this relic, which is really awesome. Cybrex Warform. And it gives us 5,000 alloys. And it also increases our monthly alloy production, which is big. And it only costs us 150 influence. I'm going to fire this off right now because of the cooldown time. Because part of what I want to do now is go into here and do uh, and get rid of that Calgary Destroyer. I'm going to go to the defense platforms and set these all up. So let's start with all my. These are all designs that I wish I could kind of save across the board, but you can't. So. Communication is established with the Mutagen Merchant Guild. We don't have crystals, so we can't use the crystal plating. So this becomes defensive platform G for the guided missile part of it. And I don't... This other thing over here, 
auxiliary fire control chance to hit I don't think it affects these is why it's not on there but that's just kind of a guess so what I really want to do is start getting some of these other ones built up so I got kinetics and plasmas and I'm gonna add chance to hit as long as I don't need extra power for shields which I don't so this would be kinetic long range and we also do this and somebody said something there's always a, a little bug here so what do we have what do we have hmm. whatever it said it's not saying that anymore. it's hard to hear because there's that error there's that bug in there which is real kind of a pain in the butt so there's a bug that when you're on this screen and the advisor talks to you you get garbage which is a real disru oh, no. disruptor here. Okay, I'm going to pause that and put this together first. So this becomes kinetic dash M. I want to build a couple more of these. I want to do penetrators. So pin M because they're penetrators, the disruptors are. Plasma. These things do damage to armor and hull. <coughs> then we'll go in here and do the, I need to do one of these. Back. Missiles. I, I, auxiliary fire control does affect those, I'm pretty sure. This becomes PD for point defense. And then last but not least is the little short ones. I can do the hangers too, but I'm not going to do them right now. So I want these. Doink, doink, doink. So these become penetrators for short range. And then also at short range, I like to do some of these too. I don't like to do the kinetics. The kinetics fire at long range. The whole idea is that the the whole idea is the kinetics will take down the shields from long range, and by the time they get close, then you plow them with this and kill their armor and all. So, anyway, that's the plan. I still don't know if it's completely sound or not, but it's what I do. Alloy metal forges. Let's see. We got auto cannons, research from researchers, alloy mega forges, which require moats. The rail again. We're gonna send him on the rail again thing. We're gonna come down here, and we've only got six slots. So, oh, and there's a defense platform hawk, which I don't care about. Get that off of there. Okay. So we're gonna come over here, and we're gonna say one long range there, and then two. Oh, the kinetic. Never mind. Don't do that one. To the kinetic long range one. Kinetic medium range. Point defense one for those there we go do those build those upgrade this so that'll be this, this could end up being a very important choke point for us complete. and yes your construction is complete so let's go fill out the rest of these holes 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 there is a research world here And there are crystal mines. You can put one on this planet. So I'm going to put that on first because we need to start getting crystals. And any planet that lets us have one of those special things is is deserving of it. What's going on here? Prioritize your clerics, which it wouldn't. It's not going to matter changing that, but I still want them to be prioritized. Let's put you to work. This place needs one more. Let's take one off the homeworld, off Darzakia, and put them on Python. One more unemployed person. Minor. That works. So over here, then, we can build this. Gas extraction wells are going to go on this planet this size. So is it done? Crash Starship, a small canyon. That's it. Crash Starship. It's done. We have discovered a new archaeological site. Oh, it's new. Okay, where's it at? It's right there. Oh, I see. Oh, and you guys. So you're kind of stuck. I see. 
Can you do experimental subspace navigation then? Can you go like here? Yeah, do that. Move over there. Darzakia. I want to get my bureaucracy under control here. Uh oh, we lost our governor. We've had him since the beginning. So do you have anybody with research? No. Clear blocker time. Don't really care. Leader lifespan. Okay. Building district cost. That's probably the better one since we're building a whole bunch of buildings on here. But we lose our research bonus, which is... Boo. Not happy about that. Yep. So, oh. Drought. The unstable climate on Asterius has resulted in severe drought that affects a significant portion of the planet. Colonists living in those regions have asked Dorzakia for financial aid to improve li living conditions. Okay. You can have that little bit of money to do that. That's fine. Trappist. How much, what do we got for resources over here? All we have is exotic gases. So... All we have is exotic gases, and how soon before they grow another person? Soon. So I should probably raise that up and give them an extra, give them some extra jobs. What is this? And that's Governor. Yeah, we know he died. Chenner Combine Maker Corporation has established a new branch office on Asterius. So, corporate. China Combine, eh? So that's you fools over here. If you start making me corrupt. Start causing me corruption. I'm going to go with the China Combine is what? Ruthless capitalists. Okay, well, at least they're not a crime lord syndicate. Those guys were a pain in the butt last time, weren't they? During our inward perfection run. Man. Forked chain. A number of individuals belonging to the pre-sapient native population on Heishma 3. Somehow got into a secure compound on the outskirts of the colony. Chased off within hours. Took a bunch of credits with them. Hmm. Voyagers arrived at the cam system. Okay. That didn't take long. Hmm. That's strange. I just want you to start exploring. Unstable weather. Devastate. Wow, that's... Groupy. Okay, so now let's go back over to species. What do we have here? What do we have here? We got the Darzax. We only got one of those people. We want... We got one of those people. I don't want to modify the template. I want to apply this template to the one guy who's not doing his thing. Takes 10 months? Oh, that's probably a bad choice. We got these guys. They have amenities from jobs. Let's create a template. Let's remove that. What can we give them? And they're on a continental world. So some of their guys are going to be leaders. So if you're going to be leaders, I want you to have research. And we will apply that template as soon as we can. Gene modification. He was almost done with those points. Probably should have waited. Let's go to... Let's abandon that project. Oh, it's eight months away now, though. Okay. We'll just do it. Incoming transmission. Defensive pact. Decline. I swear if I could play this game without sneezing, it would make my day. <laughs> if I had a mute button on this thing, it would be so great. Okay, so archaeological site is fully finished. It's the Oracle. Yes, so initiate communications. We're going to add this to a planet. Remove archaeological site. No, we're going to initiate communications. Who are you? What happened? You will aid us in the administration of our empire. Plus 10%. Research complete. We'll take that bonus. Gene modification. Okay, tile blockers. We need to get more of those off of there. We need to find the ones with the, the bad doggies. So this adds to yep, the Oracle. Admin capacity plus 10 and it still didn't get us over that hump there. Still have a little bit of a problem with that. I need crystals. Crystals is what I need. Two of these jobs here would be tough to automation on. No, I don't want automation off. Colony is being managed. Mainly. This is going to be our EQ Monopolis. So, what I'm going to do to start getting us 
ready for that is putting things on this planet like this, the autochthon one. I want to put those crystals on there too, but we create any crystal plant somewhere else. Can't remember what's building. Is it Trappist? No, nope, that's building research complexes. Are we getting are we earning any? Where are they at? That has research. There it is, right there. Crystal mines. Planet limit one of two, so I can put one more on here too. Well that's nice. So we should start earning crystals when we are. Rare crystals we're earning. And these cost forty-five to upgrade. And one for upkeep, so we're lacking thirty-three. Now what you can do is, since we have some, we can buy some. So I can go like this. And then I can go up here and say, oh yeah. So I can upgrade that one. And I can upgrade this one. So that's going to use the two that we're earning. But it gets these buildings upgraded. And it's going to take care of this Empire Sprawl over here. And this 12.85 12 that we're taking to our technology cost is going to go away. Which would be nice. You, on the other hand... Do the, oh, and I don't have to buy so many of those anymore, which is good. Keep doing that. And species just modified. Waiting for more. Okay, species modified. Great. Let's go to species. Oops, what happened here? Incoming transition. We will give you minerals or energy credits. The free warriors, so they don't come after us. Senate has a vote and passed the resolution. Form the Galactic Council. There's going to be a vote. We're not... We're not up there? Oh. Somebody's ahead of us. The China or Combine is. And so is the Zum. Tranquil. Hmm. Okay. Well then. Leveraged profiteering. That's what's going on there. Right. So be it. You folk here. You need to... I need to get... What's it take to raise these up? Crystals or moats? We gotta get the tech first before we can do it, so. They're just sitting there. Saying, I got a bunch of unemployed pops. It's like, I know. I'd like to put them to work. But we can't. And I don't want to move them off world, so they're just gonna stay there. 300 days for an administrative park. Colony established. Hey, this is on the Gaia world. Yes, it is. Oh, it's going to be a very nice mining world, isn't it? Oh my goodness. Construction complete. That's going to be pretty. And what's it do? Minerals from jobs, which means, yes, mining. And minerals from jobs, mining. It's all mining. You're, you're almost a matter decompressor all by yourself. You're awesome. Railgun. Okay, minerals from miners. Yeah, we want that planetary build speed. What else do we got? Cruisers and star fortresses. And habitats. Let's unlock the cruiser. Okay, this one. If I want to raise more buildings up, I need to put your crystals down now. So I'm going to do that. And I'm going to build that because you're going to have people ready to go soon. I'll probably build that. This is a research world. Same situation. I don't think it has any special things on it. Nope. Okay. I'm gonna put crystals down now so we can start upgrading some things. Incoming transmission. Form Federation proposal. What kind? A research cooperative. Oh, I'm in. I'm in. Yes, I want to form a form. <laughs> Communications established with the Zero Corp. Yeah, I want to be in a federation that's a research cooperative because free and automatic research agreements, that's nice. <laughs> but the nicer things come up here research speed, get bonuses, diplomatic weight from tech, rare technologies are unlocked by another federation member now up here at two times the normal rate. There's a bunch of nice things here. It's just the two of us for right now, so we can go in here and say, yep, we gotta, we gotta unlock things. Secession term, vote weight, 
There's a bunch of stuff we can change over time, but this is nice. I don't mind being there. I don't mind being in a federation that's a research cooperative. That's awesome. <clears throat> I mean, eventually we won't be because we're going to have to go crush it, but... What are you doing? Do this, build that research, and then go over here to the Cybrex and grab that. Okay. What is this? Galactic Council Emergency Measure. This is the uh, ban organic slave trains. So they're, they're, they're that worried about it that they had to make it an emergency measure. Okay. Down here. Oh, yeah. Clone bats. Go. This. Still waiting on some of this tech here. Oh, yeah. You guys are sucking again, aren't you? Darzakia. I'm going to raise one of these administrative parks here and put the four, two of these guys to work. Hmm. Is it two or three when these guys get raised up? It's three. Oh, good. So three of these guys are immediately going to go to work. Which will probably take care of this. We're at 16% for technology cost, which sucks. Let's get rid of that. 41. What are we looking at now? What? Repeal regulatory facilitation. Which is diplomatic weight from economy. No, the answer is no. We're going to oppose that. Darzakia, 21 days. I love seeing I love seeing these guys get jobs. That's what I like seeing. I like it when these hit their numbers and then these guys all of a sudden become employed and then this number up here changes. Research complete. Hit it. Oh, 360. It almost went. It almost did the whole thing. Cool. There they are. There's... Get those ugly doggies. Okay, so now we can go down here and say, hey, take care of that one. Cool, this other one will take a year to build. A little longer than a year, 413 days, wow. But it's cool. All right, let's go back to species and take a look at people who need to be fixed. Dar's hat. Oh, there another one of these old Darzaks got created. These guys here, so amenities from jobs. Oh, but we created this. Yeah, we need to apply this template to you. Situation How long? Updated. 17 months. That's good. Let's get you all fixed. And the ZUM, leader lifespan, minus 10 years. Army damage, 40% work proper. You guys are going to be leaders. Let's uh, create a template for you. Leader lifespan, minus 10 years. No. Actually, we want you to kind of in the other in the direction. What do we have here? Federation Association Status Request. Sure. We'll have as big a federation as we want to because we're eventually going to have to go to war against somebody. So I'd rather be in a position to kick butt. Is what I'd like to be. are going to end up with a lot of unemployed pops, aren't you? Why don't we just start shuffling some of you off then to other continental worlds with some jobs? Like here, you can have one. Other continental worlds with jobs. Trappist has a couple. Oh, no, can't decline. Don't want to do that. Don't want you to lose a spot, so... Comet sighting. Incoming transmission. Federation Association request from the Beldross. Well, sure. Federation Association offer, yep. We'll build it up. The whole point is to defeat the endgame crisis. Now, I want to conquer the galaxy too, but in the long term, it's like... The gas extraction wells, that's nice. We got it. how many on this planet? Two. We gotta get those on there, but right now civilian industries is the most important thing. And do a little more mining. And make sure we have happiness over here so that that gets taken care of. Good job. This is their research planet. Chemical plants, gas extraction wells on this one as well. Planet limit of one. Let's give that person a job. 
Oh, and who died? An envoy? Scientist Harry Robbins has died on his ship. So let's get somebody in his place ready to take over. Darzakia. Oh yeah, he's assisting with Darzaki even though we only have like what no research left on that planet anymore. None. He doesn't need to be assisting there. We need to get him on an actual uh, on an actual planet with some research. So where's all our research at? Yeah, Minok. Yep, go research okay. there. That person and this one is Darzaki. Yep, so go over back here to These planets, isn't there? Go there. What's that one doing? Where's that one at? It's right there. Okay, boy, you're. Can I just put you on automated survey? Automatic exploration. Automatically explore the galaxy. Go for it, dude. Yeah, we'll put you on evasive and have you do it. Just find some stuff for us, man. Okay, you have an unemployed pop and we can put you to work. Dangerous wildlife is going to get taken care of, which is going to be great. Darzaki is about to take care of this number up here. Empire Sprawl, we're at 3% for technology cost. And in 30 days, we won't have to worry about it, which will be great. Which will be great. And how many of these are we earning now? Five. So we can start raising up another one even. Because this is going to put two people to work and create one job. And as long as it takes these to come up, yep, and that job's going to be filled like immediately. So. Research complete. Nice. Okay. Let's raise up the next one then. Research complete, zero point reactor. What do we have? Research speed, plasma accelerator, energy nexus. Let's go research speed with her because it matches her. She's at 74% on that. You have an unemployed pop. What would we like to do with you? So what is this? Do we want to go with food and and then use the rest on housing? Probably. Let's do that. We keep building that up. We keep building our civilian industries up. What are you doing here, Bucko? Building good. The Cybrex, because we need that. This is going to be so much fun when we can finally do this, these ring worlds. And so who's this? The Oov. The Oov. And we are in a federation with them. So the Oov over here, these are our federation buddies. Oh, yeah, because they're blue. So that's great. So earlier I was thinking I needed to go over here and I needed to uh, worry about building a choke point, but it's like, nope, we don't need to. So let's do terraforming right here. Has climate restoration. What? <gasps> it's a tomb world. Oh, that's why. No, I have climate restoration for tomb world. Okay. Species modified. And what happens if I build a... i find out, actually. If I build a thing there. Species modified. The Skrull. So these guys are done repugnant you guys let's take a look at you let's create a template for you let's get rid of that and what is this army damage plus four you're very strong and there's no way i can get rid of that trait okay um leader level camp plus one this costs us one that's nice let's go research so when you're if you're caught up doing research on a planet you'll be very good at it complete. you got one one trait point left 
Let's make you natural engineers. Apply that template to all your peoples. Situation log updated. 17 months. How long is crystal pacification? Not long. Okay. Alright. There you are. Get these resources right there. Liking the sounds of that. This thing over here is being built. Let's go. Don't, don't. Defense grid supercomputer. That's the thing, man. So, who are these guys over here? The China are combine, and they don't. They kind of like us, but they're, we are in a commercial pact with them. We have a migration treaty. Okay. Now, what do we want? Domination, usually. Diplomacy, nice, though. Uh, Federation naval capacity, I don't care so much about that. Market fee, base trade protection, empire trade routes. Those are all nice. We get an extra envoy. Or enforcers reduce crime. Yeah, I like this. I always like this. Governor cap goes up. Ruler level cap goes up by two. Yeah, domination. Let's adopt that. You guys are back on the top again. Alloys. This is an alloy planet. That's what it does is alloys. It needs some growth. Research complete. Research complete. Nice. Starbase module cost. Ooh. Let's see. Let me grab this rare tech. Think about some things here. Darzakia. Administrative part. Yeah, see, I told you. It's, it's like, put those guys to work. Okay, down here in this... Oh, yeah, the embassy complex. Yeah. This gives us another envoy. I want to do that. I think the most important thing to do there right now is put down Cristales. Let's put down because I saved these last three spots for refineries, so we know that by now. Federation Association request. Zum sure we'll agree to that. System survey complete. We'll agree to that, won't we? Ecumenopolis says, hey, oh, what's it take to raise this up? Crystals, okay. Culture worker jobs. I'd kind of like that because I want to start going through. How long is it taking to do 64 months? Yeah. Let's do that and raise that up and then provide a few more jobs too. We need the research that allows us to raise up civilian industries. They gotta go up, up, up. And we almost have those guys, the doggies. The doggies. Yeah, quite the little galaxy here, 800 stars. Model 16 sequence. They don't like us and they're at minus 80 and they're superior, their fleet power is overwhelming. They don't like us at all and they would make a fine first conquest, wouldn't they? There's a unexplored wormhole over there. Any chance you guys can get over here and tell me about this wormhole? How long did it take you to get over there? Are you going to just go through a line? Can you... Construction complete. Experimental subspace navigation. Fleet stance cannot be evasive. Get over there. I want to know. I want to know because this would be a quick way for us to get over here. And I want to do some exploring because who owns this? The Zome, and they're going to be part of our federation. You guys are great. Let's go over here. Civilian industry. Doink. Trappist. You can put two crystal mines on this planet, so let's do it. Let's do that. 
Shift. Governing Ethics Shift in the Beldros. Alright. What do we have over here? This is a Spaceborne Organics Amoeba Swarm. Are they getting their butts kicked? Looks like they just did. Yep. You guys got some stuff. Okay. 3,000 and 2,200 is what their fleet strength is. So we need to be thinking about getting our fleet stronger here. What do we have for cruisers? Rail gun. And now we have crystals, we can start putting crystal plating on if we want to. How much does this cost? For the mediums, 0.45. Okay. Let's look to, oh, because I'm done. How much, what is this? 465 and 100, it's still better now. Wow. Okay. We tell these guys, sit here at long range and shoot. Yep. And so call them cruiser. K. And then I also like to build a point defense one that I end up using later. Much, much later. I'll have to keep an eye on these ships because at some point in time, the ceramic metal armor Species modified. will exceed these guys. So this becomes point defense, and we say stay up close at what is it? Yeah, picket tactics or line tactics. Should put hold advance to medium range and hold formation. I usually tell it to use that, even though the other one's called picket tactics. I tell it. I want the Corvettes at this range, at 30, up close. I want these guys in between our long range ones, and I want them intercepting everything. So that's, that's how that works. Research here, let's get you guys your magic things. Clone that. Let's give you some jobs. Let's raise that up. Let's do this. Another research one, clone that. Food. Is that a more city? You guys have. What do you got? A Penthulin. Well, I'm just gonna have to wait, dudes. Alpine world. I can't. I don't have another re world to re settle you. That's. I do. Oh, Hanum. I do too. And there's a job there. Okay. Go. Pawn them. Oh, and you need a job, don't you? Okay, let's raise these guys up. And we're cooking. And we can sell some more of this. Sell some more food. That's always nice. I want to get my bureaucracy. <laughs> it keeps creeping up. I want to stay below that. All right, let's go finish off the rest of this. Let's go fill out our gaps. Oh yeah, and so over here, this place can be converted to continental. Water. What passed? Ban organic slave trade. Very nice. Good job. Good job, y'all. Good job. E all. I thought I sent you over there. What are you doing? No orders? Dude. How come you can't go there? What if I do... Okay, what if I do this? Let's grab a little subspace navigation. You can get over here. Oh, you can't go because of that pirate station? Oh, we'll still get you over here. This guy's got a big piracy problem going on. Muchos pirating problems. What are we over here? Rare Crystal 6, you better raise another one up, buddy.
Construction complete. It shouldn't take very long for this ship to go from here to here with the experimental subspace navigation. That should not take long. Okay. So here, this thing, what can I build on this thing? Oh, I thought I could build something else, something that was unique to... Oh, there is a black hole observatory, though. Okay, I'm going to build that. I guess. Let's see, what do we want to build, then? Anchorage? Curator order. Can you assist us in our research? Five grand. Research speed ten. Yep. Do it. What else do we have? Oh, and it's the Holy Guardians. Ooh, this must be Fallen Empire. Yep. Okay. So we have our first Fallen Empire. Well then, what do we have? We have Trader Enclave. We seek your expertise. Require this Trader Enclave to have a pinion plus 50. Huh? Strategic resource. I see. So all this stuff. Interested in something else. I got you. So that's all they can provide for you. What about Artist Enclave? Become your patron. And for 5,000 you'll give us Unity. Do it. I know that gets to be really expensive, but... I want to start getting that stuff. Take care of. The EQ Monopolis. Down here, what's the next thing we can build on our EQ Monopolis? Oh yeah, everybody's going to be a stronghold, so we could build that next for you. Fun, fun, fun. Now, is there anybody out there doing research yet? Nope, there's bureaucracy. I can get a beer cat. Incoming transmission. Federation Association request by the Zum Agree. What is this? Terraforming gases. Let's go to edicts. Terraforming gases. Turn on. Education campaign. Recycling campaign. Research complete. What do you got first now here? Civilian fabricators. This is Yep, that's the raised up version of that building. We need those. We need them. And then I need to go into fleet manager here. Start taking a look at you guys. Let's say we did something interesting. Destroyers. So. These raiders. Okay. We're down to two ships. That's fine. Oh, the cruisers. Darn. I hate having Research their auto complete. ones in there with their weird names. It's like, get them out of there. Okay. Yay. We can get rid of the ugly cats. Fleet command. Leader level cap and leader upkeep. Let's do that. Okay, let's go back to our fleet. What is this? Oh, this is for... This is a cruiser design for a... Uh, for the Federation. Okay. It says this damage is 44. Our damage is 46. I'm going to go like that. Want some more of these. So what's this going to cost us? All of our alloys. Mm. 32 ships will be upgraded. We're going to upgrade.
upgrade those ships then. Over here, okay, all those places with wild animals. I'm gonna get those cleared out. Archaeology skill. Don't care about that as much, but let's just get it out of the way. Let's go look at. Bad kitties. Transmission. What do we have here? Ask for association. The allied Velvirums would like to cooperate more closely. Would you consider granting this association? Yes, sir. Sure. Oh, yeah. So let's keep going. What do we have here? Wish that panel would stay open when you're rotating through here, but it does not. You have a heritage site, so I can send artifacts and give culture workers a plus 20% bonus there. This is what I'm going to do. Crystal cabins. More bad doggies. You guys are going to need more jobs soon. You're going to need more jobs right now. My shummy. The Vera Valdari progenitors, enigmatic observers. You say your empire has come into possession of a cache of data containing the brain scans of extinct species. We would make a copy for you. Construction complete. And this place needs jobs, so before anything else happens, I'm going to raise one of those up, give jobs, and then we'll worry about taking care of the active volcano. Alright. So, what's going on up here? Where is that guy? He's right there. Great. Okay, research this. And this construction ship can build that. Hot tickety dog. And we're at Empire Sprawl. It's right on the line. Right down the line. Comet sighted happiness. Yeah, so this place here, since this, this little section over here is all, I want all these to be research worlds. So then I can get a research and governor and get a bonus. So they'll be all research worlds. Research complete civilian. Okay, defensive pull, platform hull hit points. That'd be kind of important. So is alloy mega forges. Let's grab that right check while we're there. You're back to having four people unemployed. Hmm. Well then, how many crystals do we have? Four. So I can raise up one more of your buildings. I'll put three more people to work. I could raise up two. Construction complete. All right, Mr. Construction, where would you like to go next? There's this place. Go fill that void. We're down to the last two systems that we can actually got. Oh no, three. There's three systems. And then we're done with those. I want to be completely done buying consumer goods before we go. Research complete. Colonize the rest of those. Okay. Survey speed. I don't care so much about that. Energy nexus. Let's do that. She is a level 7 of 8. Survey speed is 70%. Wow. And her archaeology skill is 7. She's awesome. And then this guy is 8 of 9. Experience 165. Archaeology skill plus 8. You guys are rocking. Ships upgraded. This planet here. 
Special mm. project complete. The circular swarm, yep. So I figured that was. Okay, you. Can you get to here? What's here? Pirates? I think you can get through there. I'm gonna bet you can get through there. I'm gonna lay money that you can get through there. Okay, research you. Darzak. Um, is there anywhere else we can find a job for you with? Construction complete. On a continental world. Obskike. What's Obskike got going on for jobs? Incoming transmission. It's got technician job. Federation Association status. Sure. Zum zum. I don't. You guys still haven't. It's still just us. Okay, what's over here? Incoming transmission. Repeal cooperative research channels. Cooperative research channels get us research diplomatic weight from tech, so we're not going to repeal that. We'll oppose that. Federation Association request from the Allied. Yes. You can have association status. Right down the line. Oh, yeah. Any place that's got like one job, I gotta start worrying about building. Um, what are you guys doing? What's going on here? You're just not. You just don't have a lot of clerks, that's right. Let's do that. Let's give you guys a chance at some jobs here. Oh. Save it. Build that. That'll give you a bunch of clerks. That's why every one of those gets one of those. Every planet gets one of those. Okay, cool. You guys are here. Do this. Research that project. And then research that project. And these guys who we sent over here. Where? Over here to find this wormhole. They're still subspacing. They couldn't make the Kessel run in 12 parsecs. They couldn't do it. Okay, so this place. What do these cost? These cost crystals to go up, and what do we have? Oh, we gotta start putting some of your people to work, so. That's what we gotta do. Research. This is gas extraction wells and research. How's our research looking compared to everybody else? We can go look at the victor screen and see where we're at. So there's two fallen empires. Which potentially means a war in heaven, which would be kind of awesome. So I want to go look at those folks. But here we are. We're at 1325. These guys are at 1252. They're the ones right behind us. And then everybody else is half of what we have, which is great. So let's go look at the fallen empires. Um, who are they? The Valdaria and the S. Jagun. So the S. Jagan, Holy Guardians, they're going to be spiritualists. And then uh, the Val, who are going to be fanatic xenophile. Hmm. Do you think... I wonder if that'll be a war in heaven, if they're going to be different enough. So here's the S. Jagan right here. Where's the other ones? Oh, and the Vals are over here. Ooh. Okay. The nice thing about the Val, Dari, being over here is they're between us and the Marauders. So, I like that plan. Enforcers reduce crime. Capital buildings provide housing. Governor level cap. Capital buildings and housing buildings provide one house at least. I think we should grab that. As this episode gets close to winding down. This is the big thing now Special here. Oh, I see this. Those guys are secured. That's good. How many do we have left to secure for that? The alien species procurement. Got two left. Where are these guys at? Go to. It's up there. That's where our, our ship is headed next. And then this one, the elusive Tarbalak. 
go to? Where's that at? Oh, it's way over here. Okay. Well, we can get to there, too. And then we can get all of them. We can get them all collected. Just like raids, shadow legions, collectible RPG. What the hell is a collectible so RPG? <laughs> Spandex RPG. Uh, oh, cool. There's the research institute. Mm, we're going to need that soon. Not right this second, but I want to get it... I want to get it researched. Oh, man, you know what I'll tell you? It's a weekend. It's a research weekend as I record this, and I still don't have... I still don't have my whiskey from ReserveBar.com. By the way, ReserveBar.com, if at any point in time you want to sponsor my channel, I would love it. <laughs> Plead for sponsorage from those guys. But they've been so good to me during the pandemic. I, I was like, you know what? The last thing I want to do is go walk into... Uh, a, a crowded liquor store with my mask on searching for searching for liquor I just want to order it from online and have it show up to my house and uh, and that was fabulous because that's exactly what they do so they always have some pretty decent sales on stuff that I like to drink which is nice uh, but I don't have any of it today and it's the, the day is winding down on a weekend but I have I have a Bud Light Clamato in the fridge. I may have to I may have to partake of that for the next episode. <laughs> That's starting to sound like I'm just such a huge fan of Bloody Marys. And I'm a huge fan of them because my wife at my wife's restaurant they make some of the best ones I've ever had. And uh we have to thank a bartender named Brian for that cuz they were good Bloody Marys and then my wife hired this guy named Brian for a while and he worked there for several months. Brian's a fabulous dude. He moved because his wife is a college graduate, and she got a job somewhere, so he moved. Uh, we hated losing Brian, but Brian was fantastic, and Brian made amazing Bloody Marys. <laughs> and so, and so, uh, of course, anytime somebody comes in like that to work in your restaurant for a while, you know, you want to take the best from them and, and retain it. So we did. It was like, oh, they're just so good. It's one of my favorite things to do on a on a Friday night, which is actually what I did last night. My wife will text me and say, "Hey, come down, come down and get a pizza and some and some some drinks on me." And it's like, "Hell yeah, okay." I don't like to impose on her restaurant. I don't like to be down there all the time. And I actually pay for my meals because unless she explicitly wards me off, I pay for my stuff because I know how hard it is to have a small business and and you can't be giving away free meals and free drinks to family and friends or you're you're going to go out of business real fast. So I tell my wife, no, I'm happy to pay and I'm happy to tip your servers big, you know. But she called me down last night. She's like, hey, come down and have a pizza and have some drinks. And I went down there and had two Bloody Marys and they're just so good. But the Bud Light Clamato is like the closest thing that I can find. Just And it's great. It's in a can and it tastes really good. And it's like, uh, I'm, I'm not a light beer drinker. I don't like domestic light beer. Not a fan. But the Bud Light Clamato doesn't taste like light beer. It tastes more like a Bloody Mary. Not not the good ones like our restaurant make, but you know. It's like, oh, it's a nice red beer. Okay. And I like that. Good, these guys are finally going to get a job here at the Darzacs. On the guy world. Get that open. So this is... This is all promising. I like where we're at. This building the we're administrative park... Complete. We're starting to get up above Empire Sprawl, finally. Uh, habitability, another 5% for that wouldn't hurt. I want the civic slots, though. I want to see about that. We're going to save up some influence. I think it's 250 to do that. Special project complete. Okay, so those guys are secured. That's this up here. Construction complete. So what we can do is... I think if I tell them to just go over here, I think they can get over there and do it. Over here, I would like this next slot to go toward, what are we short on? We don't have any moats and we're going to need moats, so let's go make some moats. All three planets, every planet is going to get one refinery each. That's our rule, that keeps us out of trouble. And when the planet's full, we'll take and replace the robot assembly plants in the, in the clone vats. And grow other things there. So we're going to put some chemical plants down, these guys are still looking for more. Oh yeah, and so 
we're gonna take the clone vats and replace it with replace it with um, this commercial zones. I'd like to get the embassy complex down for another envoy if for no other reason than you can take envoys and assign them here. And so the 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 Uv Zant coalition. If we have any envoys, yes, which we do, making relationships with them, we don't need to do that. So we can assign them to here now. And uh, they're assigned the Pan Galactic Information Cooperative. And this will help with our uh, cohesion. And in fact, let's see, what are our other envoys doing? The China, the Beldros, and the Penthulans. The China don't like us, but we need to keep them because they're overwhelming. The Pens, I don't need to do that anymore with them. So here's what I'm going to do. I'm going to take the ones from the Penthulians and assign them. And we're going to see, and we're going to start moving in the right direction now with that, with our cohesion. Relic activation is now available, which is kind of awesome. The only problem is I want to save the influence for what we're going to research. So, so it sounds like it's time to stop. It's been an hour. Wow, it's been amazing. This is... We all know what's going on here. It's like a normal playthrough. It's like any other playthrough I've done, even though it's Grand Admiral scaling and we expect things to get harder as it goes along. We're playing for the crisis. We know that's going to be the hard part of this game. That's going to make the crisis really exciting. So thanks for watching, everyone. As always, if you dig the episode, give it a thumbs up. If you like the channel, subscribe. If you have a question or comment, drop it down below. And if you want to support my channel on Patreons, in the description below. I'll see you all next time. Thanks for watching.